yes, we're connected. <laughs> um, it's time for the children's message, and I know I see we have one little girl here. Would you like to come down? Are there any other young at heart people? <laughs> Hi, Claire. Good to see you. Come up here. I found a recipe this week. Do you know what a recipe is? No. No? It's, it, it's instructions for making something that to eat. It's, uh, it can be a dish for dinner, or it can be a yummy dessert. This one, this recipe I found, I thought would be good for us to have at the end of our little fishes session out there. And it's for trail mix. And these are the ingredients um, that you need for that trail mix. I just want you to check that I got them all, okay? So I want you to check each one, pick it up and put it, don't unwrap it, but put it in that bowl when I tell you what it is. So, do I have any Chex Mix? Can you see any Chex Mix on that table? Does it look like anything? I think this is Chex Mix, isn't it? You put it in that bowl then, okay? Can you see any M&Ms on that table? Yeah, okay, so put those in there. Now, what about goldfish? There are two kinds of goldfish I need, yeah. One is cheddar, one is pretzel. Okay, and yogurt raisins. Do we have any yogurt raisins? Yes, okay, so we have all the ingredients, and we're going to go through there and put them all in that bowl and give them a good stir, and then we'll have a treat, okay? So that set me to wondering, wouldn't it be nice if we could find a recipe for having a happy life? Don't you think that would be good? If we could find a recipe, instructions that we could follow and know that we'd have a happy life, yeah? Well, actually, there is a place where you can go for a recipe for a happy life, and that's the Bible. Jesus taught the people what they needed to do to be happy. And that section of his teachings is called the Beatitudes. Now that's a really funny word, isn't it? I don't think we come across that word in any other place other than talking about that little passage in the Bible. So I like to think of it as two words. Be, how we should be, and attitudes. What kind of attitudes we should have. So I'm just going to give you four from the recipe, okay? Jesus said, be merciful to people, meaning be kind when they're hurting and forgive them if they do something you didn't like. The second one is be peacemakers. So if any of your friends are arguing, fighting even, Try to calm things down and bring them back together again and make them friends again. That would be a good way of being a peacemaker, wouldn't it? And then two attitudes. Jesus said, have an attitude of pure thoughts. So try to think of things that are good and lovely. Okay. And finally, have an attitude of wanting to do what is right. Sometimes it can be tempting to do things that are not right. But he wants us to have an attitude of always trying to do what is right. Yeah? Now there are some other items on that recipe and we'll look at them when we go out there. Okay? But for now, let's try and follow what I've just read out. And we'll just say a prayer. Okay? So let us pray. Dear God, thank you for the B attitudes. Please help us to follow your recipe for a happy and blessed life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, can you carry that, do you think? Was it heavy? You can carry that, can't you? Good. I'm seeing a new recipe for communion next Sunday. It'd be kind of... <laughs> <laughs>